what I felt in Montreal, being for years a wannabe writer and a wannabe filmmaker and, and not quite getting to the level I wanted, even, you know, there was a thought of, should I leave, go to Toronto, should I go to New York, should I go make these bold moves? Perhaps. In the end, I stayed here for personal reasons, for all kinds of reasons, but I stayed in Montreal and I'm pleased with that. The idea that was always present for me was that if I wanted to know something, I could always approach someone who's done better. If I didn't know something or wanted to improve a certain skill, I could approach whether it be a filmmaker, film producer, or other professional that's accomplished something. We're, I think, always proud in Montreal of these, of these folks that do well. And even though they might have an opportunity to leverage their works across the world and nationally, the younger ones or the ones up and coming, I think, uh, can ask for mentorship in Montreal. I think mentorship's a big part of our attitude, even though it's perhaps unspoken and it is developing in more formal circles and business as well. There's mentorship groups and that sort of thing. I think across the board, the different ecosystems and the different industries, whether artistic, creative, etc., Montreal is a good school for everyone.